name is Thomas Cedarback. Well, I grew up in Rhode Island. Met my wife while I was going to college. We've been married 28 years, and we have five children. I actually was in the Navy active duty in the 80s. I joined submarines, but my mother got sick, and I had to get out on a humanitarian transfer into the reserves. And I finished off my time. And I think 1998, we decided we needed a little like, extra money, so I joined the Navy Reserve. The Navy Reserve is the, um, the part-time job for the Navy. You do two days a month, two weeks a year, and I joined the Seabees because I was working in that field. The CB is the construction force of the United States Navy. We build anything from buildings, roads, bridges. We train with Marines out in the field. We build, we fight. I still get a good paycheck, I and mean, that's what we use to pay for the extra stuff. It allowed me to stay home, and it gave us that extra money coming in. I'm very proud that my dad's in the military and that he serves as a CB. Not only is he a hard worker, dedicated, all those things that you typically think of when you think of a, a military person, but he's also very compassionate. You have your family, you have your civilian job, and you have the reserve side. Now what you gotta do is make the reserve fit your civilian and your, your family. You don't make the other two fit the reserve. The benefits are great. We get health benefits which we can buy for a good discount versus a, a civilian. I mean, we also have college benefits which a lot of people use. My daughter's actually going to school and is paying for her school. She's gonna get out with a four-year degree at University of Rhode Island. <laughs> She's probably the hardest worker I know. She should be a CV, but she doesn't have the time to do it. As a reservist, you're obligated to do one weekend a month. Shooters will be firing my M2 HB 50 caliber heavy machine gun. It could be 3M training, which is prevent the maintenance on big equipment like this. We may do a convoy immediate action drills, which could be a, a driver down or. Gun it down, gun it down! And you keep practicing it, it'll be second nature to you. Good job. You're gonna do it correctly the next time. I actually got laid off three years ago and I was mobilized, so it kept me off the unemployment line for about two and a half years, which was great. I used the experience I had, and I, I put together a pretty good resume. And I actually got this job at the Navy War College based on my Navy skills that I've learned as a CB. Being a CB does help me in my civilian job in that I'm learning construction management skills here on the drill weekends, and I'll become a better leader. You have to take care of your people to move ahead. You're only as good as your people are. Join the Navy Reserve. You get the best part-time in America right now one weekend a month, two weeks a year. My name is Thomas Cedarback. I'm a senior chief in the United States Navy Reserve, and I'm a CB. I am the senior enlisted advisor for um, my detachment. Uh, we are a hospital unit, doctors, nurses. Someone who's a jack of all trades, uh, responsible for loading and unloading cargo. As a reservist, there are a number of opportunities to do these humanitarian relief missions. CB is the construction force of the United States Navy. We build anything from buildings, roads, 